I got myself out of shape, I got myself in this depressed, just lonely, terrible place, then I can get myself out of it. Um, yeah. And some mentors came into my life, Joseph being one of them, who's on here right now. Um, Joseph and, and our two other business partners came into my life. And really, at that time, honestly, they saw something in me that I didn't see in myself. Um, they kind of breathed life back into me. They breathed confidence back into me. And a lot of that came from this fear of going all in again and that it would be taken away from me. Uh, this fear of trying 100%, putting all effort into anything, career, and have that being taken again, into a relationship, have that being taken away from me again. Uh, and it was just, I was just stuck. Uh, but they began to build confidence back into me and then plugged me into a system with the business that they had developed at the time um, to where I could just go out, implement what I had, which was hard work ethic, and then just put my head down and, and see results quickly and then build upon that. There's not a single successful person out there that won't tell you that a, a, a strategic mentor at the right time was the key to their success. One big thing that one big thing that I'm so against, I cannot stand the phrase self-made man, self-made millionaire, self-made whatever, because it does not exist. Like the fact of saying someone is self-made is just completely disrespectful to every single person, whether good or bad influence that they were, but they made you into, you, into who you are today. We got Joseph Caldwell here, and um, a lot of you that have been following any of my content, um, you've heard me talk about these mentors that came into my life uh, three and a half years ago. Okay, Joseph was not way. one of them, um, <laughs> but we're glad to have him here anyways. <laughs> Because he knows them. He knows them. So it's like. I know some, I know some of them. <laughs> Fucking talk about them. <laughs> no, but in all reality, Joseph has been one of the biggest mentors and person that's been instrumental in this transformation that I've gone through over the past few years. And um, I'm extremely grateful for that. I'm not going to look him in the eye when I say it, but um, it's a podcast, so you didn't see it anyways. I have just realized where I wanted to go in life and what my purpose was and surround myself with people like that are similar mm -hmm. and wanting to go and do something special too. Um, you know, a lot of times people in my position, they talk about they pulled themselves up by their bootstrap and I'm never gonna feed people that shit. Mm -hmm. I'm not a self-made man. Uh, I look around and everything, most, almost every decision I make, I've learned how to make that through mentors in my life. And so that's why it's such a special, it's a special thing when you look down and not look me in the eye and call me a mentor. <laughs> <laughs> Don't spit that coffee or water you just drink. <laughs> Everything you've been through creates who you are. And it can create who you are or it can destroy and keep you where you were. That's the choice yeah. of the individual.